once again welcome to a new session in this session we will discuss about arithmetic progression ap through this session you will easily understand what is the concept of arithmetic progression and how to solve different type of problems relating to arithmetic progression firstly let us see what is the meaning of arithmetic progression an arithmetic progression is a sequence of numbers such that the difference of any two successive numbers any two consecutive numbers is a fixed number or same number an arithmetic progression is a sequence of numbers like 1 2 3 4 such that the difference of any two consecutive numbers is a same number for example in this series 1 2 3 four there is a common difference this is 1 then 1 is deducted from 2 difference is 1 when 2 is deducted from 3 difference is 1 when 3 is deducted from 4 difference is 1 so the common difference here is 1 so an arithmetic progression is a sequence of numbers such that the difference of any two consecutive numbers is a fixed number like this for another example 3 5 7 9 in this series the common difference is 2 so this is also an ap arithmetic progression let us be similar with some more example in order to grasp the basic concept of arithmetic progression i have written a question here which of the following list of numbers does form an ap if ap find out the next two terms we have been asked here to check whether this is an ap series if this is an ap series find out the next two terms also firstly we have to check whether this is an ap series the question is for 10 16 22 like that in order to ensure that this is an ap series we have to find out the common difference of this series to find out the common difference we can deduct the power from 10 here 10 minus 4 is equal to 6 then 16 minus 10 is equal to 6 22 minus 16 is equal to 6 so the common difference is same here so this is an ap series then we have to find out the next two terms in order to find out the next two terms we can add 6 with the last term to find out the first term here the first term is 22 plus this common difference 6 is equal to 28 then the second term is 28 plus 6 is equal to 30 let's look into another example 1 minus 1 minus 3 minus 5 let's check whether it is an ap series minus 1 minus 1 it will become minus 2 then minus 3 minus minus 3 minus 3 minus Minus three, it will become minus two. Then minus five, minus minus three, minus five, minus minus three, it will also become minus two. So the common difference here is minus two. So this is an AP. So let us find out the next two terms. Minus five plus minus two is equal to minus seven. Minus seven plus 
minus 2 is equal to minus 9. So, these are the next two terms which we are asked to find out. So, let us move to another 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3, such that. So, let us set 1 minus 1 is equal to 0, 1 minus 1 is equal to again 0, 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, the common difference is not same. So, let us be sure that this is not an AP series. We are moving to find out the nth term of an AP. The formula for finding out the nth term of an AP is an is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. Here, a is equal to first term. d is equal to common difference. n is equal to total number of terms and n is equal to n the term. Among a series of numbers, we are asked to find out the n the term. I will explain this with an example. We have been given an AP series. We are asked to find out the 20th term of the series. The series is 3, 5, 7, 9, such that. We know the formula for finding out the nth series. This is a n is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. Here a is equal to first term. First term in this series. That is 3. a is 3 here. d is common difference. Common difference between two consecutive numbers. Here 5 minus 3 is equal to 2. Common difference is 2. This is obtained by deducting 3 from the second term. 5 minus 3 is equal to 2. And here is the number of terms. So let us assume that there are 20 terms in this series. We are asked to find out the 20th term here. So n should be taken as 20. n is equal to n the term that is here a 20. Let us apply the values here. n a 20 is equal to a 3 plus n minus 1 20 minus 1 into d 2 20 minus 1 is equal to 90, 19 into 2, 38 plus 3. So the end of the term is 41. Another type of question here. Which term of AP 21, 18, 15 is minus 81? In this question, we have been given AN of minus 81. We are asked to find out what is the position of minus 81 among this series. Where does this minus 81 stand among this series? Is minus 81 the first position? No, the first position is 21. If this is the second one, no, 18 is the second one then what is the position of minus 81? That is what we are going to find out. So, we have been given an of minus 81. We have to apply the known values in this formula. Minus 81 is equal to an minus 81 is equal to a, what is the first term? a is 21. 21 plus n, we do not know we have to find out that n minus 1 into d 18 minus 21 minus 3 into d so minus 3 ok then minus 81 is equal to 21 plus n into minus 3 
minus 3n minus 1 into minus 3 plus 3. Then minus 81 is equal to we can add these two digits. So 21 plus 3 is equal to 24 minus 3n. So in order to simplify, we can bring this digit into this side minus 81 minus 24 is equal to minus 3n. So n is minus 105 divided by minus 3 is equal to 35. We can conclude that minus 81 stands in the 35th position in this series.